The number four ranked UCLA men's tennis team hosts the UCI Anteaters. The Bruins will try to continue their five-year shutout streak over the Anteaters. UCLA has dominated UCI in previous matches, not giving up a single point to the team since February 3, 2011. UCLA men's tennis team will set to continue their long winning streak after their strong showing at the National Indoor Championship last weekend, where they reached the semifinals before losing to number one ranked UNC Chapel Hill. known each other for quite some time now. How does that chemistry contribute to your play on the court? Um, well, it's always it's always easier playing with someone that's a close friend. Um, just knowing his game, knowing my game, and like knowing where we complement each other, our strengths and weaknesses. Um, it's just it's just easy to mesh on the court. Like we move well together. Like we play well together. So it helps us. It helps us obviously get wins. And like we've been doing really well, especially this season. So um, yeah, just going back like we've been playing together for t almost two years now and it's just over time you just like get more comfortable playing and it just gets better over time. Now you two are number 12 nationally ranked. How, how are you guys going to move forward with that momentum like throughout the season? Um, I mean, you just got to come out with the same mindset every day. It's not like, oh, we're 12 now, so we have to we have something to prove. It's like um, maybe we have a target on our back now because um, now we're 12, we might move into the top 10 after the rankings come out on Wednesday. So people are going to definitely want to, they're going to be more motivated to play us and get a top 10 win potentially. So um, from our side, is we just got to stay solid and just keep doing what we've been doing the whole year and just stay focused is the biggest thing. You guys started off the season as number 15 and now you're number four. What do you think is contributing to that success? Uh, I think we're doing a pretty good job in doubles. Uh, I think we only lost one of the, our doubles matches, so we pretty much won zero every match so far and, and it makes our lives easier. And I do think everyone is in good form. I don't, I don't think there's any spots on the, on the lineup that, that are weaker or like that strong. Everyone is playing playing good tennis. and. If someone doesn't show up a day, we have like a whole the whole team behind them. So I think I think that that's been helping. And then you guys were just on the on tour. You were in Virginia for the national championship indoor open, and um, you guys made it to the semifinals after losing to UNC Chapel Hill. Do you feel that like being on the road is like a better setting to play because you're you know with each other in hotels and you're just like it's a different type of atmosphere and chemistry, do you think that helps at all? Uh, it depends. I mean, last year we struggled a lot on the road. We did really well here. Um, this year, I don't really think, I think what happened, what helped us was getting there early and getting uh, used to the setting and practicing a lot there and getting used to the courts and everything. And that's, that really helped. We had a match before in before National in Northwest Virginia. So we were really, really acclimated once it started. and and we were right there to beat UNC and they are number one in the country so so that gives us I guess a good taste of what where our game is and just how much we have to improve. Mm -hmm. 